The Kid America Club. Are you ready? Go! No. Well, it's actually like a really cool concept. It's about cartoons and acting crazy. And Frankie in third base and Carruthers. Yeah. What are you doing, man? Pay attention to the TV. You're not gonna learn anything. Don't listen to him, Frankie. He's not even real. Sesame Street is like the bit. That's more the basis of the show. The way Sesame Street is a variety show. You know that that. They just would suddenly feature a milk documentary mixed in with a puppet talking to a kid, mixed in with a little cartoon, mixed in. So that. Like kids don't need to focus on a big plot. They just want to see, and I think that's what the adults are like too. We started the show on public access in 2002. When the show kind of caught on. We had the New York following. They showed the show in Japan. It is a big play on TV and TV watching and TV surfing and the MTV generation of not being able to handle things for very long. So just cut everything off, right? As you think it's building up. Third base is the greatest, as in me. Third base. I'm in charge of it all, and I'm a Guido from Queens. In case you didn't know. This is how we started this show, man. Basically, we started going to comic book conventions and interviewing those crazy retards there. Man, are they crazy? If you could make your own superhero, what would his name be? Uh, Mike. What powers did you have? All of them. <laughs> All of them? Yeah. Like what? Super strength, flying, power blast, the whole deal. I kind of um, been working on an idea of my own leopard man. What? most popular TV show, mini, mini program within the, the Kid America Club is the TV Plus Action News, which is uh, the club characters go out and they interview people on the streets. Thanks, bitch! Hey, everybody! We're gonna show you how to get some go fronts today! Let's go! Hey, do you know where I can get some gold fronts for my teeth? Yeah, you were folding. Where else could you go? Any jewelry store? Nah, for those teeth, nah. You got a lot of money there! Yeah. Are you gonna buy some gold fronts? What's so cool about gold fronts anyway? I don't know, so I got money, man. We do Little Hipsters, which is uh, featuring all these little guys. They're wacky. They're stupid. They do a lot of drugs. They like to go to parties. They seem cool. They like to nudge. Little Hipsters. <laughs> little Hipsters is basically a puppet show featuring all of downtown's crazy derelicts and losers. Basically lampooning the culture that we know best of the hipster culture of downtown New York. Because that's what we're all about over here. We're about imagination, about fantasy. That's how we always saw it anyway. And it was just, it just never went away. We just yeah. always kind of, yeah, we never let go of it. The aesthetic, the, the plastic, and the children's records and cartoons, it was always, it was always just with us. And we were reared by um, some strange parents and TV just saved our ass. Show's over, homie. See you next time, motherfuckers. <laughs>